All right, guys, so let's go ahead and talk about the next updates coming to the iPhone here in the near future. iOS 16.3.1 is currently being tested. We'll talk about when we can expect a release for this software and why Apple is working on iOS 16.3.1. Now, of course, in this video, I also want to talk about iOS 16.4, the next major update coming to the iPhone. So let's just dive right into this video. Now, as always, if you would like to stay up to date with the latest iOS news and Apple software updates, of course, don't forget forget to subscribe and make sure you turn on those notifications so that you don't miss another episode and now apple is working on ios 16.3.1 according to mac rumors their website shows activity from the software and this is no surprise apple does test software internally before releasing this to the public and even beta software before it is released to developers as well so ios 16.3.1 let's talk about this first apple is working on the software according to mac rumors now this could be released here shortly because there's a few issues and concerns that many users have reported ever since the release of ios 16.3 a little over a week and a half ago. Now, the first thing I want to talk about is Wi-Fi connection. So if you're having issues with your Wi-Fi on your iPhone and you're trying to use your Wi-Fi and you look up and randomly is disconnected, well, you're not alone. Many users continue to report on iOS 16.3 that the Wi-Fi connection just isn't persistent. So this is an issue that I'm hoping Apple will address with 16.3. Point one. Now, something that's happening again, which is, in my opinion, a bigger concern, is a storage issue. So if we go to general and iPhone storage here, many users continue to report that their iPhone once again is reporting that the storage is full, although their iPhone just isn't full at all. So the software is having a bug that reports that the iPhone is completely filled with stuff, and it really isn't the case. And this is a major issue, of course, because, of course, you can't take pictures, record videos, download apps, because the iPhone really thinks that is completely maxed out on storage and it isn't so yeah many users continue to report this again once again because this was happening before with ios 16 remember a few months back and hopefully 16.3.1 will be released here in the next couple of days so let's talk about release date because i'm thinking apple will release this next update on the week of the 6th of february now the filming of this video was on the third so over the weekend apple does not release any software updates so expect the next update 16.3.1 to be released on the week of the 6th of february now let's talk about another update coming to the iPhone is 16.4. We've been expecting this beta for a little over a week now. We thought Apple would release this week. It doesn't appear to be the case. Apple did not release any new betas for 16.4, but this one will bring bigger updates in terms of new features. So 16.4 aims to bring Apple Pay later. Tim Cook itself said that this will be releasing soon, so soon could be a month and a half or so. We're also expecting Apple Savings, so an Apple Savings account for your iPhone as well, and we're expecting the iPhone message contact key verification alongside apple music classic and also some home kit improvements as well so 16.4 beta 1 could also be released as early as next week this is something that's happened before apple will release a minor software update in order to patch a few bugs which would be 16.3.1 and also a major update as in beta 16.4 on the week of the 6th as well so next week should be packed with new releases for official releases and a new betas as well. So I'm looking forward to next week. Let me know if you've encountered any of the bugs and issues on 16.3. Thank you for watching, guys. I just wanted to share those details with you guys. Have a great day. Have a great weekend. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.